So I'm in the land of America and I'm visiting uh, Alex and Steve from Acon Tirebella and I've been harping on about this since February but um, in case a couple of you are wondering why I decided to go and see the lads is one, I think they're cool and two, I haven't driven left hand drive for a while and two, it was really cheap, the flights were super cheap direct from where I live so this trip is going to cost me probably 300 euros because uh, the lads are going to put me up and I have uh, food and all but now I'm blocked in and the lads are going to put me up and feed me and look after me but I'm going to do some work with them but um, here, why not? I'm about two hours from the guys and we've actually never met face to face, we've Skyped but um, anyway I will update you when I get there So it's day two of Reese's Great American Adventure and I'm helping the lads getting their timber yard ready for a mill that's coming tomorrow. <coughs> so um, we've got to pull some timber around the place with tractors and get the place set up so this big mill can come in and they can cut all their wood for Arabella. So should be really cool. I uh, haven't done a huge amount of timber work yet but we've done some um, getting stuff ready kind of for laminating. It's very humid. I got loads of water. It's very, very, very humid. Even wearing shorts and humid. And it's only like 11 o'clock in the day and it's so warm. And they get up really early as well, it's 6 o'clock in the morning. I'm really glad I came over. The guys are really, really nice. And they're even a lot nicer than I even expected, and I expected them to be nice. Um, but they've been really, really nice. And they're really, really, really focused on this whole boat build. I mean, they're up. They're up at 5, 6 o'clock in the morning and working till 7, 8 o'clock in the evening, go to bed, get up in the morning, do it all over again and in between they're somehow making these unreal videos as well. And this is actually where the boys are getting the trees for Arabella. This is where they're getting all of the wood. They're taking it from this woodland and that's the pile. It's a really big pile. And um, I think tomorrow they're going to have this mill down so they'll be able to get all the timber ready and stack it ready to try out properly for uh, for this year when they're going to be framing this year um, so that's going to be really cool and they, by the end of the year they'll probably have a lot of planking done so that's also very exciting but yeah this is the wood pile and there's insects everywhere it feels like a breeding ground for dreams you know and that's the cool thing about this whole thing is I came over to meet these guys because as they put it they put a back signal out and were like hey if everyone's as nuts as us come and meet us and it's drawing in some interesting people um, and I think that's what people are missing is how kind of how open-minded this whole thing is and how kind of if you've got an idea or a dream or something a bit mad that you can gather all these interesting people together and do it um, so one thing if you're thinking of doing something um, you can do it to be honest um, just do it and like these lads are fucking doing it look at this they did all this. So apparently we're the building, we came over to build boats with the lads, but apparently we're clearing the road for the mill, but they're, they're definitely getting the Avis Gardening and we don't even know it. Idiots. <laughs>
you doing? Making some mashed potatoes. You're gonna mm. destroy the environment with those mashed potatoes, you know that. That's what we do best here, <laughs> at Cordero <Anchor Arabella. laughs> I'm very tired, are you very tired? Well, I'm exhausted. <laughs> and I may possibly have a broken foot, so... He's just a pussy. <laughs> just excuse after excuse. Hey Mike, how are you feeling? Exhausted. <laughs> what, did we, what did we do all day? We uh, gardened. <laughs> we did the gardening. <laughs> we did the gardening. <laughs> <laughs> this man is uh, pretending he's broken. <laughs> you just want to be a pirate. You just want to be a pirate. Can you guys just chop this off and put this there? No problem. <laughs> or maybe this. This would be better. <laughs> so we spent all day um, basically stacking wood for them. But I think it's firewood. I'm not sure. Firewood? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Apparently they're duck beams, but I'm 90% sure we were just doing their gardening. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this you got some crappy stuff in your garden. <laughs> <laughs> Day. Can't stop these fuckers. <laughs> <laughs> well, James texted this morning and said he would come if we were willing. So, if he's game to mill in the rain, I'm game to mill in the rain. Done it before, we'll do it again. <laughs> All the machinery is getting stuck. Yeah, the machinery is getting stuck. It's too wet. And I have a flight to catch. So, we'll finish it up on Wednesday. Thankfully, Tom's going to let us hang on to his skid steer. Thank you, Tom. We owe you. Anywhere in the world you want to go, buddy, let us know. <laughs> <laughs> well, I have a flight to catch, so we're calling it a day. And I'm going home. <laughs> Reese enjoying driving a 1998 Chevy Silverado with a V8 and a bench seat. <laughs> Says it's the most American vehicle he's ever driven. I can't wait to get a gun. <laughs> yeah, that's later today. Oh. Trucks, guns, and tractors. Welcome to America, <laughs> folks. <laughs> it's hot. Short, yeah. short, short. <laughs> yeah. There's a lot of explosions in there. A little bruise there, I'd say. <laughs> well. That's it for my uh, great American adventure. And I'm telling you, I was really sad to leave the lads. And um, for two people I've never met properly before, um, they were really, really, really cool. And I got on really, really well with them. So, yeah. <laughs> we don't, like, we don't got our toes, toes, to think, like a finger smashed up today. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> I definitely was not just. <laughs> 